Warren Buffett is one of the most successful and richest people on the planet. With a net worth of $84 billion, when the Oracle of Omaha speaks, you listen. Buffett has made his fortune through making smart investment decisions in the world of stocks and shares, essentially making him, as many would say, the greatest investor to ever live. Today, we're going to go over 8 tips and rules that made Warren Buffett one of the wealthiest people in the world. This channel is going to be covering a lot more successful people in the upcoming videos. So if you want to succeed and continue growing, then be sure to subscribe and hit that bell notification so you never miss a future video. Let's get started. In Warren Buffett's own words, investing in yourself is the best thing you can do. Excellent advice. Invest in yourself, whether that be getting more education or working towards improving a skill, investing in yourself should always be top priority. Buffett spends a lot of his time reading, which we'll talk about in a moment, so it's a no-brainer that one of his top tips would be self-development. Once all is said and done, you are the main focus in your story. Everything you do in life, to some degree, is affected by the choices you make and the way you respond to each situation. It's not surprising that Warren Buffett has achieved what he has, considering the amount of time he spends improving himself. According to Warren Buffett, habits can make or break you. The trick is to get out of the trap before it closes on you. In a speech to graduating students at the University of Florida, Buffett advised the students to form good habits as soon as possible. He said this in regards to bad habits. You can get rid of them a lot easier at your age than at my age because most behaviors are habitual. Some habits go unnoticed until it's too late. The longer the habit has taken root, the longer it takes to change it. Always remember, the chains of habit are too light to be felt until they're too heavy to be broken. The quicker you realize your time is your most valuable asset, the sooner you will begin to protect it. Buffett says, having money makes you rich, having time makes you wealthy. This by no means is saying that making money is a waste of time, it just means be more wise with the time when it comes to making money. Figure out a way to make more money in the same amount of time. Find ways to make passive income, this way you have more time to spend with family and friends. One of my favorite quotes from Warren Buffett is, If you don't find a way to make money while you sleep, you will work until you die. Invest. Start a business. Learn to make more interest on the money you already have. Remember, time is limited. No one knows how much they have. Make the best of it. Being around the right people is important in anything in life. Buffett often talks about the importance his mentor, Benjamin Graham, has played in his life. One of Buffett's closest friends is Bill Gates. Not a bad company to be around. Buffett advised high school students to spend time with people whose qualities they admire. He says, pick out associates whose behavior is better than yours and you'll drift in that direction. Take time to find the right people you want to be around. They will influence some of the behaviors you'll exhibit. To quote motivational speaker Jim Rohn, you are the average of the five people you spend the most time with. The time you spend with others and who you surround yourself with will play a big role in your achievements in life. It's a simple concept. Avoid areas in your life that are known weaknesses and spend more energy on building your strengths. Buffett says, you don't have to be an expert on everything, but knowing where the perimeter of that circle of what you know and what you don't know is, and staying inside of it is all important. In essence, capitalize on the areas that are familiar while steering clear of the ones that are less familiar. It's not that taking risks is wrong, but do it only for the right reasons. When you have what's important, don't go and risk it all for temporary satisfaction. Buffett, to his core, is someone who made a living by managing his risks. He's done a pretty good job, and I'm sure you'd agree. Managing risks is something that everybody should learn. Sadly, some people are so desperate to get that moment of pleasure that they risk everything they need to obtain it. Buffett says, if you risk something that is important to you for something that is unimportant to you, it just doesn't make sense. I don't care if the odds you succeed are 99 to 1 or 1000 to 1. It's important to understand, while risks are unavoidable in business, being cautious is a must. Never test the depths of the river with both feet. Though much of his advice is on the conservative, cautious side, Buffett is a massive believer in grabbing opportunities when they arise. 
We don't do very many things, but when we get the chance to do something that's right and big, we've got to do it. And even to do it in a small scale is just as big as a mistake as not doing it at all. You really got to grab them when they come because you're not going to get 500 great opportunities. Sometimes good opportunities come along and we do not realize them. Don't pass up a great opportunity because you have to work hard or it makes you a bit uncomfortable. Most of the time, you will feel uncomfortable, but that's with everything in life. You need to be on the edge of your comfort zone to fully embrace growth. As Warren Buffett put it, opportunities come infrequently. When it rains gold, pull out the bucket, not the thimble. Considering where he is in life, his analogy isn't too far off from his reality. Warren Buffett is a big reader. He reads between 600 and 1000 pages per day when he was starting out and still invests about 80% of his day to reading. Buffett once gave students in an investing class at Columbia University the following advice. Read 500 pages like this every day while reaching towards a stack of manuals and papers. That's how knowledge works. It builds up like compound interest. All of you can do it, but I guarantee not many of you will. Most people go through life stuck in the same mindset. They don't grow, they don't take risks, they refuse to do anything. Why? They just don't want to do the work that's required. It's pretty easy to come home, sit on the couch, and watch TV until it's time to call it a day. But what good are you really doing? To quote Charlie Munger, go to bed smarter than when you woke up. What was your favorite tip from the Oracle of Omaha? Leave a comment below and let us know. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification for more videos like this on a regular basis. Thank you.